I expected not to find a match, and I expected not not to find anyone. The most exciting moment in all of this has just been putting my hands on my sister's face and giving her a big hug and a kiss. My name is Diane Ward. I was adopted when I was a few weeks old. My name's Mary. When my birth mother gave birth to me, the next door neighbor agreed to babysit me. And one day she just did not come home from work. Because it was the 60s, it was much easier to say, are you willing to take care of this child? And they did. When I got older, I did start wondering where I came from. I would be in school in science class and all of the kids would be paired up and I would always have to put my hand up and say, I'm adopted, I can't do this assignment. When I hit about age 14, I realized that I had an identity crisis. So I took out the old fat yellow page phone book to find people with my same last surname. And that's Delta, so it's this right here. And the internet became more of an option to access information. Companies like MyHeritage came along, and that was revolutionary. They actually had a gene pool that they would match whether or not you had any relatives that were a close DNA match to you. So I thought, well, that's a game changer. A couple years ago, it was Christmas, and I just thought, I'm just going to take the chance. So secretly, I did it, and I sent it off and very shortly the results came back. I did have a close match. Our cousin told me there was a person who had been matched on my heritage to her, but she believed it was a closer connection for me. And when we talked on the first video call, we talked for ages and ages and ages. Mary mentioned that she was going to take the DNA test as well to make sure that we were really half sisters. I just took one look at her and it took the breath right out of my lungs. I was so shocked. That triggered all of these happy emotions for me. And it was absolutely a joy-filled moment. I was pretty excited to be nervous. Attention in the airport. Attention in the airport. Hey, Sister! <laughs> oh my god, it's so good to see. Oh, it's really real. <laughs> it's this sisterly connection that I've heard people talk about, but was never able to experience myself. Mary looks like our mom. When I found out that my mother passed away, it was really hard for me. I just feel like my mom lives through her. The similarities are so many, I don't even know if we can quantify them. Like, when we showed up the airport, I had all my flight information in a folder. I'm so glad you're organized like this. I'm the binder queen. We have very weird senses of humor. You're like, wild by my beauty. I am wild by your beauty. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag I roll. All right, I got the tickets to Hawaii. Let's go. Let's go. We're out of here. We're ditching them in. We were like peanut butter and jelly. I was already playing to her. She was mine. She was half my half sister. I wasn't giving her back. It's just the best thing that's ever happened. It's just been really an experience that I wish for everyone. It was so easy and changed my life. I feel like I won the prize and I have my heritage to thank for that. Do it. Don't hesitate. Just do it.